The UK general election is just around the corner, and we think it's time for you to take your local politicians to task. From free expression, to misinformation, media literacy, and funding journalism, there's all sorts of threats facing the media industry. Do you want to see things improve? Well, here are six key questions you can ask your local parliamentarians in the upcoming general election. Sinister lawsuits that are targeting journalists have skyrocketed since the last election. And people who are harmed by powerful media groups have no means of accessing justice when they are wronged. Providing low-cost alternative dispute resolution that works for all needs to be championed so that high court costs don't prevent people from accessing justice. Freedom of information has plummeted in recent years, with people unable to get access to that information because of growing backlogs. What will your parliamentarians do to ensure that people get access to public information that should be available to all? It's crucial that everyone can tell fact from fiction when reading the news, especially since the rise of deep fakes and the new challenges that come with generative AI and misleading information. Public research and education initiatives are one of the easiest ways to combat these issues. So, what support is being offered for these initiatives and are they being championed? No one should be left to feel underrepresented by the news. There are hundreds of local and hyperlocal news outlets up and down the country that are trying to do just that, support their communities by representing the issues on the ground that matter, being voices for the voiceless, informing, educating, and holding power to account. But these outlets are struggling and we need additional support for them so they can continue to do their jobs well and provide news that's representative for all. New regulations for social media are now here, but that's just the start. There's more we can do to ensure that our young people and ourselves are free from harm when we're online. So we need regulations to go further and ensure that they address dis and misinformation and other online harms coming down the way. There has long been a reliance on ad revenue in the news industry, which means now that income is scarce, there has been a prioritization of sensationalism and clickbait to grab attention. What we need are new models for publishers to be able to fund themselves and become sustainable in the long term. So we need greater innovation and support for that innovation for local media and the national publishers to ensure that they prioritize quality over quantity. So if you wanna learn more about media issues ahead of the election, head to our website at impressorg.com and specifically our page on general election issues, impressorg.com slash general election.